everybody and welcome back to Manifestation Budgets. I hope you're all doing really, really well. Um, today I'm going to be doing a unstuffing and cash condensing um, and it's the biggest one I've ever done. Um, I think I've only ever really done one or two on camera. Most of the time it's just something because I didn't have a large budget and a lot of cash in the house, it was just something that I would do here and there. Um, obviously, if you've watched my previous videos, you'll know that we fully funded um, Angel Numbers which then made us be able to fully fund the iris binder. Um, and then it also meant um, that we are able to fill up our sinking funds and there's now a lot of cash in the house that we need to get back to the bank. So we're gonna go through each um, of the binders one by one. So we've got five in total. We've got Christmas, birthdays, short-term, long-term and challenges. Um, and we're gonna be going through them. I don't think we're gonna condense challenges, so it'll just be the four here, but that's the five binders that we've got. We've got our placeholders here, I've got a selection of different ones. Um, I've not got that many, so I'm hoping we'll have enough. Um, there are some within the binders that we'll go through and take out as well. Um, and we'll just see how we get on. So I need to get, actually, I did not prepare myself. Um, I'm just going to use my little um, planner here, um, just so that I can note down what I'm doing, what I'm taking back to the bank. Uh, so we'll just use this little felt tip here just so I can keep track of what I'm doing because otherwise I will definitely lose the will to live and I've got my little calculator there to help me as well so let's get cracking so we're going to go to Christmas first and see what we can take out here there's quite a bit to be fair so we completed our challenge this one here Sorry, I'm wrecking everything. We completed this challenge from Budget Ridge SR, uh, which saved £500. So we should have £500 in this challenge here, and this needs to go back to bank. So we've got 300 in placeholders, and then we've got 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 200. So we'll put the money in here. So we've got 20 and 10s. This the placeholders can go in there. Um, oh, that's a bit tight. So let's put these in the right place. And um, we need a 500 placeholder. So oh, I might just put these on here for now, actually. It might be easier. So we've now got £500 in Christmas. But we've only got 200 in cash going back to bank. So we'll do Christmas. Sorry, I'm not going to do neat writing today. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm really knocking you. Um, 200 in cash. Um, and the rest of these are challenges, so I'm not going to unstuff these, but I might condense. So how much have we got in here? 10, 20, 5, 30, 5, 45. So we'll put these in here. We'll get 40 pounds. 20 and 40. So we've got 45 now in there. Oh, it's so exciting. I've never got to do one of these videos properly before. So I'm over the moon with that. Snowflake Falls, what have we got in here? Um, take these two fives out and put in a ten. So there's ten pounds saved in that challenge so far. What have we got in this one? Let's have a look. Thirty, so we can swap two tens for a twenty. So there's now thirty in there. Brilliant. What have we got in here? 12. So we can swap these two for a 10. We'll leave the coins as they are. What have we got in this one? Uh, we've got two notes. Oh no. Oh, we've got. We can swap this. Oh, actually, yeah. Let's take this out. So we can take out five, five and put in a 10 in there. This is exciting, loving it. Uh, what have we got in here? We've only got eight pound in there, so we can't do anything with that one. What can we do with this one? We can do 20, so 25. Brilliant, so that's Christmas all done is great love it love it love it so that's christmas done okay birthdays so this birthday is fully funded and this birthday is fully funded so we should have 
I've got the fully funded placeholder already in there. Oops, sorry, you're not in view. Fully funded placeholder in there, and then we've got this one in here. So, yay! Let's just count this up. I think it should be 120. 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 10, 20, yeah. Perfect. So that's birthday. Oh, I'm going to have you. Birthdays 120. I'm really sorry. I've got my camera at a slightly different angle and it's really not secure. Let me see if that's any better because it's just really, really wobbly. So we've done birthdays and Christmas. So now we're going to go into short term. There's quite a few to do in here. I don't know if we're going to have enough placeholders. So I want as much money out of the house as possible. So gifts, we've got 50. So gifts, we can put 50 in. So gifts, 50 pounds. Beauty, 50 as well. 20, oh, using our cash tray now. Oh, 50 again. I think these placeholders were from um, the Budget in Bear, but I got them from Charlotte Studio Budgets when she was selling a few of her bits and pieces. So we've got Beauty. I'm so sorry if this video is really shaky. It looks it to me. Um, but never mind. Sorry. Clothing. Let's see what we've got in here. I think we can do... I think it's 100. 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. Um, see if we can get all of them matching in this binder. So 100 in clothing. Clothing, 100, home, I think it's 50, yep, that can go back as well, 50, so, oh, little one, it's still sleeping, but probably won't be sleeping for long. So let's see if we can get this done. Eating out. 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. Yeah, that can go as well. Oh, placeholders all stuck together. 100 in there, which is great. So eating out. Out. 100. Perfect. Car. So, oh, I need to clear off the tracker. But 100 in the bank, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200. So, 100 going back to the bank. So, we can change that for 200. I'm not going to put fully funded in just because we are going to start topping it up for different things. So like car maintenance, car insurance, stuff like that. Um, and this is what I'm talking about when I was saying I was going to do um, new envelopes because if I do, we're splitting up my categories a little bit more. So there's 100 in cash going back to bank for car. Family fun. Let's see what we've got in here. I've got 30, 40 in there. So let's swap that out. And keep that in cash because we're going to save up £100 in total. Poll. I think there's 50 in here. I'm going to take that back to bank because I have to pay on my card anyway. Um, keep the fully funded placeholder that's in there ready. 20, 40, 50. So, poll. 50. Okay, uh, dentist is fully funded at £30 and opticians is fully funded at £150. But I'm going to nick these placeholders because I'm going to need them. I'm going to need them. So, yeah. So we've got quite a few fully funded in here, which is great. And, yeah, the only cash is in family fund, so that's good. Much more condensed. 
which is brilliant. Okay, now we're on to long term. So, the first one we've got is our rent savings. Now, let's see what we've got in here. We've got 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 40, 50. Right, let's get that all back to bank because there's no way we're going to be keeping this challenging cash because it's over a grand. We can just put these 150 placeholders in here. Um, and then we can mark off another one when we get up to uh, 160. So that 150 can go in rent savings. Now, emergency. This is really exciting. So let me get rid of that tracker so we've got 500 700 800 in the bank and then we should have 200 in cash here 20 40 60 81 20 40 60 82 so 200 going back to bank so that is emergency 200 in cash and then all these and come out and I want a fully funded in there because we're going to stick to I'm going to put it that way so our emergency fund we're going to say is fully funded because it will stay like that for quite a while to be fair school I think it's 50 in here as well so that might as well go back to the bank 50 yeah just get all the cash I'm thinking get all the cash out of the house um just for safety reasons and then we can go from there so let me get rid of these bigger oh. someone's at the door one second hi everybody i'm so sorry about that it was a community nurse coming to see the little one um so i had to see her sort that out and then i've put him in his high chair he's just going to watch a little bit of tv just while i finish this off really quickly so where was i up to oh we've put 50 pounds in school they said he was fine, they said all his stats and everything were great, so that's really, really great. So £50 in school, then autumn, which is our half-term holidays fully funded. Sorry, I'm out of breath, just ran up the stairs. <laughs> 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 100, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60. So that's all going to go to the bank. 160... There we go, so autumn, 160, god this is getting messier and messier as it goes on, uh, so that's fully funded, autumn, fully funded, I've got these little stickers in there but they're just getting in the way, I'm just going to move them out of the way, so autumn is now fully funded at 160 and then anniversary I think there's a hundred in here 20 40 60 70 80 90 100 so yep 60 70 80 90 100 uh, yeah we'll put this one in here 100 pounds in anniversary lot going back to bank isn't there and then nothing in easter and that's it isn't it that's all the four binders so let's give this account up and see what we should have going back to the bank so i'm going to speed this up should have 1330 going back to bank so let's see what we've got <gasps> 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 40, 60, 84, 20, 40, 60, 85, 20, 40, 60, 86, 20, 40, 60, 80, 7, 20, 40, 60, 80, 8, 20, 40, 60, 80, 9, 20, 40, 60, 80, 1000. Oh, 
And then we've got 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 200, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 300. Oh, what have we done? I've done something wrong here. What have we not written down? What have we not written down? Hmm. My gosh, right. Okay. <laughs> One four eighty. Take away one, three, three out. Oh. One hundred and fifty. Where have we took? So we've got an extra one hundred and fifty. What was that from? Rent. Rent. Okay, that's fine. I figured it out. So yeah, we took one hundred and fifty from rent, and I didn't write it down. Wow. Okay. So that's that, 1,400, what did I say, 1330 plus 150, 1480, Ooh. 1480 pounds going back to bank, wow, look at that, look at that, that's insane, absolutely insane. Let's move this out of the way. Let's get a really good picture of all this money. So yeah, I can't believe it. I've never had this much cash in my life. <laughs> and I've got loads saved already in my Monzo pots. What I'll probably do is we'll do a little bit of a count up. I didn't do a count up at the end of um, August to see how much we'd saved. Um, so what I'll probably do is do that probably just at the end of September. We'll skip August and we'll do September. Um, and yeah, and so this is gonna go back to bank. It's gonna go in my Monzo pots. I'm gonna split it up into all the categories. Um, and then yeah, at least now we're starting off from not having loads of cash in the house. Um, and then when we cash stuff, um, yeah, we're not kind of adding to this because I do not want this amount of money in the house. Um, it's just too much. I'm only insured, I think my home insurance is insured up to £500 cash. So really, I want to try and keep it down to 500 if I can. So yeah, thank you so much for joining me for another video. And I hopefully um, will see you in my next one, which should just be either a game day or my general cash stuff. And it just depends on which one comes first. So I'm off to sort this money out. I'm going to get it back to bank as soon as I can. Um, there's actually also a little bit of money here. Um, I think it's... 80 pound i think is it this is also got to go back to the bank because this is for passports oh no 20 40 60 80 1 140 yeah this is going to also go back um to the bank and then 35 pounds needs to just be transferred across over to autumn because i took the cash from passports to add to autumn so yeah that's it oh i've got all this money can i even fit this in here so yeah this needs to go back to bank like as soon as possible because i really don't want this cash in the house um but yeah so that's that and we've got five pounds here as well it needs to go back so what i'm thinking is i might take that back to bank um i might also take this tin um this has got all my pound coins in i'm probably not going to complete the challenge um because i'm going to put coins and stuff into my other binders so i'm probably just going to break this tin take this back um i might go to natwest if i can at some point, I need to see what time it closes um, and pay all this money in and then get it across to the different sinking funds. Um, and the boys have got a big jar of change as well. You know, one of those things that counts the money up. Um, they've got over £50 in there as well. So I think I might just take all the coins, tip them all in, get them all done. And then, we'll, yeah, we'll start again. I'll add some more challenges to my challenge binder and that's it. But yeah, apologies for waffling and I will catch you all in my next video, guys. Take care. Oops, sorry for knocking you. Bye.